guys, so welcome back to my channel, Vlog Losses. So, if you're new on my channel, please subscribe and press the bell button. So, guys, as you can see that I'm in my garden. So, if you're interested to have a tour of my garden, let me know in the comment section. My Nana and my Daddy worked so hard to make our garden beautiful that it looks just like a park. So guys, today I'm going to show you my top 5 favorite books. So now let's get started. So my most favorite book is this. Awesome Quran Facts. I like it so much because it is a colorful reference guide. My cousin Anam gifted to me. Let me show you the pages. So here are the contents. Discovering the Quran, Prophets and the People, Teaching and Commands. The Prophet Muhammad wasallam. more about the Quran, Places and the Landscapes, The Evil Characters Mentioned in the Quran, Like Iblis, Shaitan and Firon. So here are the Islamic expressions like Bismillah, Alhamdulillah, Mashallah. Here are the good deeds which we should do, like honesty and kindness. Over here there are five pillars of Islam. Prophet Muhammad wasallam at Makkah and then the Prophet Muhammad wasallam at Medina. Companions of the Prophet Muhammad wasallam like Abdul Bakr Sadiq. The miracles like the Prophet Ibrahim in the fire and over here there are the animals and the birds and I like these animals and in this page there are fruits and vegetables mentioned in the Quran then things from nature like rain, lightning, sun, moon, mountain, star and ocean then Mecca in this there are the main points like the black stone Mecca in the Quran. Then Medina that Hijrat from Mecca to Medina and the first mosque Masjid de Kuba. So it's all from this book. So guys now let's move to my second favorite book. It's my first book of Dua. My aunt gifted it to me four years ago. And since that time, it's my favorite now because there are a lot of duas and I read them all before going to bed. Let me show you some of the pages. So here are the contents. Duas for Wuzu and Slad. Duas for greeting and well-wishing. Duas for journeying. Duas for Psalm. Duas for Hajj and Umrah. Duas at the time of difficulty. Duas for special occasions. Duas for other prophet in the Quran. Duas for the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Other duas from the Quran, daily duas. Duas for Salat Janaza. So here are the five prayers: Fajr, Zohar, Asr, Maghrib, Isha. And over here there are duas for greeting and well wishing. Then duas for Psalm. And was for Hajj and Umrah. So now let's move to our third book. Lost and Found. This book is my favorite because it usually happens with me that if I'm not finding anything, I just clean my room and I found it. This book is by Oxford University Press. Here is a little boy and he is finding his toy but he cannot find his toy anywhere. So he is asking from his mom that do you know that where is my toy? So then he checked under the bed, under the table, even on his shelf but he couldn't find it. Then he was saying that where is my teddy bear? He thought that I should find my teddy bear in my toy box. But he didn't find his teddy bear in the toy box. Then 
he got idea to clean his room and when he clean his room he find everything he was looking for now let's move to the fourth book so this book is about Bablu who didn't like books. I like this book because in this book they tell us that why books are important for us. One day Bablu was watching TV and he broke the chair's leg. Then he got an idea to put his books under the chair to make his chair as well it was. Then. Over here he is taking some samosas and he was not reading the book actually he was reading a comic book. Over here he was taking some books because but he don't like books and he was thinking that I will take the books and don't read them never ever. Then at the night he got a bad dream that books were fighting with him and beating him because they were sad that why he is behaving so rude to us then he said sorry to books and be good then the next day a girl asked from the boy that what happened to you why are you looking really scared or something then from that day he started to read books so now let's move to our fifth and the last book is Princess Bretty Lena. In this book they tell us to be kind to others and help over. And in the last her name was Princess Angelina because she was really good to others. There was a young princess who had such a bad temper. She was Princess Bretty Lena. One day her mother tell that you should be kind to other but she didn't listen to her mother and ignore it. One day she went for shopping with her servant. First of all she saw a bakery. Then she went inside and have some muffins. She was eating but she didn't give to poors. Then over here she went to a shoes shop and then she saw pretty shoes and she want that then she went to a hair shop she do the same and even on the candy shop she was really bad girl and the um, woman was scared of her behavior then when she was coming out from the sweet shop she stepped on a old man's long braid she said to the old man that can you not see he was a magician then he got an idea to make a toy shop where she will go and buy some dolls and i will do a curse on it so then she went to the toy shop and she saw beautiful dolls and they were talking and walking she said that's impossible and i want these all dolls and then she brought all the dolls then over here the old man did a magic when she come home and play with them they were actually behaving just like princess bertilina she was then she was really crying and she ran out from her room she thought that i was being really rude to others then she started to share her things with the poor and from that day people started calling her princess angelina so guys if you like my video please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel bye bye see you in the next video Here's my little brother chasing the rabbit.